Hello, hello everybody. How are you? I'm good always. And uh, today I'm going to talk about human soul. Uh, because I think this is always fascinating for the for the people, even for the I was in <laughs> teenage, even childhood. I was very interesting about this because we all, I mean, we all, <laughs> most people thinking, are we really going to die when we when our body died? Our soul is still live? Or what's going on? Or maybe just a fantasy, we don't exist this soul at all. But we have many, many, many cases and somebody for the short period, they, they lost conscience, their body go, going die and then after all they're back. And then remember all things happen during those periods and then they, they feel they have soul that the souls didn't die so they're coming back anyway but when the people really die they cannot tell any more story that's why we are curious very curious to see after that after you really die body died the souls exist are they coming back or are they going to the new body or something else And we have lots of cases, of course. Uh, if you're interested, you always can notice that lots of those kind of case, people, people, they're coming back to somebody, become new person. We see lots of lots of those cases in in states in some other country. I, I remember in China, you have one village. There's lots of them. They remember the past life, and uh, because I'm very interesting, curious to sometimes to see those fascinating story, fascinate, fascinated story. <laughs> Sorry, my English. And uh, then I suddenly noticed something interesting, because most people. For example, we have uh, in states we have one little kid. It's not kid. It's it's just baby, two two years old. He was a remember all kind of airplane and the detail mechanically, lots of things. The parents don't have those even knowledge. The kids are so little and. And he remember he would be, was be shot down during the second war, and he died. And now he's in a new body, newborn. And but he remember lots of lots of these things, and even the parents when he later on was bring him to see what he remember from from the same thing from the. Uh, from Second War, and then uh, he noticed some of these people, and uh, even know their name, and uh, can tell the story. This is amazing, you know. And I can have lots of lots of story from from these things. It's it's everywhere in the world. So that's why I realize what's happening. Because scientists cannot prove they were, I remember they were Canadian doctor were find when people die, so he lost a little weight. The body lost a little weight and then realized, oh, maybe the soul is going out of the body. That's why they lost maybe 20, 30 gram or something a little bit. So they start doing research and they, they couldn't prove after all. 
But I think it's for our level at the moment is very hard, no matter you have modern equipment. It, it's very hard to prove what's going on. But from the other side, logically, we can see from the other side what I thinking what's going on, the soul. First, I realize in most cases, people who remember their past life, I mean a lot, not just a little, in most cases is they die very sudden. They, they die some accidents, they be killed or something happened to them and they die. And uh, then I'm thinking, because I, I was studying medicine, I was thinking, because human brain, see, we, we are, we, every day we have, uh, we go to sleep. We have four level of from the very narrow first, second, this part is dreaming. Your eye is moving fast. And then from to third to four, and then you start deep sleep. Then no more dream. dream. This is happen for everybody every day. When you start wake up, it's from the deep, little narrow, to second, to first level, that part is also dreaming. Sometimes you remember, sometimes you don't, because it can be faster, you don't remember. It can be slow, take longer time when on the surface, on the first, second level. When you go to deep, to third, fourth level, nobody It's no more dreaming, so you don't remember nothing. But sometimes you wake up faster, so you don't remember. But sometimes you wake up, take much longer time, you remember some dreaming. You see the dreaming is sometimes it's logical, sometimes not logical. It's, it's like all pieces. I mean, not in order put together, or sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not good. The reason I'm thinking is because when you sleep in your brain, your memory parts, your soul starts a little losing and came out this small pieces coming out. So you got dreaming. So when you die, now we talk about the most important parts. When you die, your body, physical body, broken, no more useful, the soul will be going away because cannot stay in this dead body continue because they cannot the soul cannot survive on a dead body so they're going out it's like coming to start to dream on the surface so they start open their memory parts all the memory is start losing if you go into next body faster sometimes very 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 fast once you die you, you already go into the second i mean you newborn body in this case you remember much much more but in that's like million of one person or even tens million of one person most of us are much longer to the to the soul going to the new body and newborn. That's why they lost majority all memory because for the time being, all this memory of that life is gone. Because that's the reason we don't know our past life, most people, most of us, you and me. <laughs> but we have some little influence, something very little left 
influence your next life. It's some you can every almost everybody you you are naturally fear of this or like that or some strange behavior is nothing to do from your parents, from your education, from your surrounding. But you do have something different. Something, if you really think about, it's not from your education, it's not from your nature. You like this, you, you, you don't like that. You fear, for example, for example, somebody fear higher. Somebody fear water. Somebody like water. Somebody like high. There's no reason. Somebody love that, don't like this. For example, myself, I, I born in China. But I love lots of lots of European style stuff and a way of living. And nobody teaching me. It's it's just from the nature. And for example, others, for example, I love water so much. I'm swimming, I love it. Uh, whenever, whenever I see open sea, I deep inside, I feel joy. But I don't join too much mountain. If I watching, see the mountain or I'm going on, on the mountain, I'm okay. Not that much. So nobody we're teaching you this. That's very strange. And uh, I think everybody has something. So, so after all, my my opinion is we have soul when you die, and the soul is left to you going away. They were looking next body. It can be animal, can be human, can be something else, right? In in the Buddhism, they, they tell you if you're bad, you will go in to the somebody, you going, you're not, not be, you'll be this, be that, they talk, talking a lot. So anyway, your souls continue going to somewhere else, some other body. It can be animal, can be a human being, can be something else. But in the majority, most situation, because the soul is left giving little loose for the old memory. That's why you, every your life, your life, you don't know. Your soul is from somewhere else, from somebody else. You had uh, many lives before. You have no idea. Because you don't remember. <laughs> your memory is gone. So you get new body, you get new memory. So we're thinking we have only one life. That's in most case. We don't, because we don't know who the last life we are, and what kind of living is. But we have something we prefer. We have something unconsciously, like or not like, or, or some behavior, or something. It's influenced from last life, or even much more before, not just the last life. So that's my opinion. We cannot prove, but we see the facts. We see the fact what's happening because we cannot, at the moment, human cannot prove by modern scientists. But we have logically, we have so many cases from Asian time up to today, all over the war, all over the war, every nation have those story. But now I put all these kind of story and put together, see the facts is, yes, you do have so 
when you die out of your brain or body and they were going to have new life sometimes faster sometimes slow but most time we don't remember who we are from last life anyway <laughs> that's why when you die you die <laughs> your body is definitely is is finished destroyed will be destroyed whatever you know but your real mind your soul is in most cases going to be new have new life that's what i'm thinking but uh, maybe you have some other opinion if you're interesting discuss with me and uh, this is always fascinating for everybody who alive at the moment. <laughs> so, okay, hope you enjoy and uh, you can think about it. according to my theory. Is it logical? Of course, I'm thinking so. But anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching to the end and uh, Wish you like it. Okay, bye bye. Next time, I'm talking lots of other things too. <laughs> so we can always, I mean, having questions and uh, discuss and talking each other. You can send me a message, of course. Thank you. Bye bye.